Okay, here's the finale, the Siege of Hefei Castle. I never thought they'd get this far. Lu Jun. This will teach you to treat me like a kid. I can see it now. Alright, as always, the intro. Thanks to the efforts of Zhang Liao, Kalko emerges victorious against the Wu forces at Heifei. Wu is forced to retreat to Jiandong, further establishing Wei's power in the Eastern Plains. Wu once again challenges the forces of Wei and their enjoyed prosperity. Soon, Jian leads his army in preparation for the final battle. On the other side, Wei, determined to meet this threat, begins to strengthen its defenses in preparation. In 234, the Wu army surrounds the new castle at Heifei. The forces of two skilled warriors, Sima Yi and Lu Zun, prepare to face off in a battle with the fate of both countries on the line. Alright, the equipment, the weapon, we have a third weapon, which is a good thing. The items, we're going to keep them the same. The bodyguards, the highest we have is four, and I'm going to keep them at four. Alright, the conditions are the same. If uh, Sun Jian is defeated, we win. If Cao Cao is defeated, or if I die, we lose. Actually, I don't even think we have played this battle with Sun Jian as the commander. I mean, Wu's forces, yeah. But I don't recall Wei. I could be wrong. It's been a while. Alright, the info. No, there's one last change, like I pointed out before. Taishu Se replaces Lu Meng in this battle now. From here on out. Every time I play a Musu mode, I mean, when it comes to those 10 uh, gen uh, characters, those 10 Musu modes, it doesn't matter which order you do it. I mean, when it comes to Musu modes in general, you just do it in any order you want. But uh, yeah, so Taisha replaces Lu Meng in this battle. I think that's the only change with Taisha in it. Anyway, we did the intro, so let's do it. Don't let the enemy near headquarters. Hold steady until reinforcements can attack them from behind. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is go to the other side and defeat Zenji, the only non face character. And I think I mentioned it before, under any circumstances, do not go in the center here. Don't even, even think about going in the center of that bridge. Because it doesn't matter which side you're on, whether it's Wei or Wu, a cutscene will appear and archers will literally surround the entire square. And that's something you don't want to happen. Alright, so let's defeat Zenji. That's one down. An enemy force has appeared to the rear. So they've come. Destroy them all.
Alright, so now we're gonna go and defeat Lushun and Taishus. Uh, And I want to try to get the auto war in here. If we can. Really? I'm too young to die. Oh. I defeated an officer. I heard you were this good. All right, now Taisu, sir. Alright, now we're gonna defeat Zhou Yu. Is it Zhou Yu? Yeah. Zhou Yu. I thought that was uh, Sun Chang Chang for a second. Oh, you know what? Let's go for Zhuge Jin and Sun Chao first. Since they're right here. Alright, so we defeated Sun Chao, but where is... Where is he? Where is Zhuge Jin? Let alone, where is my horse? I think I left it out here. Alright, he's still inside. Alright, so that's, that take care of both of them. Wow, that was a little bit difficult to say for some reason. Well, anyway, now we're going to go for Zhou Yu. Let's kill some of these troops while we're at it. My KO count's kind of low for this battle at the moment. They joined against us. Yeah, you're going first.
I defeated an officer. I can't die here. Not me. Alright, so the only general that's left other than Sun Qian is is Gan Ning. And we'll take care of him now. Okay, I thought I passed the entrance. Here it is. So, the last general that's left is Gan Ning. We're gonna defeat him now. It can't be. What? Reinforcements? All units charge! Settle this now. So now all the gates are opening because the reinforcements arrived. And we still have to defeat Gan Ning. You're, a <laughs> You're not getting health back. And I can't believe he shielded every single Musu. Alright, so that's every general. Now we're gonna buy some time. Don't fall behind. I mean, I st still need to get the Musa wine and the dim sum. But we're gonna wait and just to see. We're gonna have to wait for a bit because now you have to wait at the bottom. And you see in the dialogue there, we like show you all the battles and everything. Whoa! Yeah, sometimes it, I always debate whether or not me grabbing this thing is really worth it, but, well, yeah, I totally forgot about those archers there. I mean, I did, but the attack wasn't that bad, usually. If you really want to get that, by all means, every time I play this battle, I will get it. And no matter which side you're on, you're going to be facing the opposing archers. That's another thing that's kind of something I don't like. But right now, I'm going to go get some health because, yeah, that attack did a lot. I can just only imagine if that would have happened on hard. I would have been dead already. But at the same time, I'd probably be shooting them off one by one by one. Much better. Alright, so like I said before, we're going to have to buy some time because <clears throat> the dialogue is at the bottom. Like You'll see something appear saying a special item has appeared or something like that or has been discovered. You have to defeat... Well, the item is called the Auto War and the Auto War is an item that you equip... Well, an equipable item, obviously. And what it does is doubles the... If I'm not mistaken, it doubles the time 
every time you pick up a battle axe, uh, battle armor, or a seal. So you'll get 60 seconds. Basically, you'll get a whole minute of double attack, double defense, and 20 seconds of max muso. Uh, that I'm not so sure about. And every time you come around here, you will enter the wind corridor trap. Okay, so over here will be the dim sum. I mean, like I said, we're just trying to buy as much time as we can so we could, uh, so we could get a, yeah, so we could get that item. And we're gonna enter the wall of arrows trap soon. Just keep on going, that's the thing. And watch out for those crossbows dead straight ahead because you're gonna get knocked off either way. Unless you just do what I just did and go around. And you're not gonna kill me. Oh, by the way, the wall arrow trap also affects the other guys too. Doesn't matter who it is. Or it just affects the enemy because I'm getting hit by arrows and I'm not getting hurt. Anyway, we're gonna go and continue on and grab the other weapon. Like I said, we're just gonna wait and wait, just wait for a bit. I, that's the part I don't like is waiting. We're gonna have to wait in order to uh, get the item, though. And that's the problem. It's just waiting. All right, so I'm not gonna go all the way back with. I was gonna say similar ye. Sal Sal was to grab that third item, but I'm gonna grab the one over here too. But it's gonna be on the opposite side. So we got the weapon. Now we're gonna grab the item. Alright, so, 14 minutes, it should be appearing soon, I think it's every, I think it appears within the 15 minute mark, I'm not sure about that though. So like I said, we're going to start killing off troops for a bit. Yeah, I don't think we ever played against Soon Jian in this battle yet. So, 
This is a first for me now. Video wise, of course, but uh, I have played this battle with Soon Gianna's command before. It's strange, the item should appear by now. You know what? I'm not gonna even bother. There's one more time. I know I have a feeling well, I still need to check, but I could always do it afterwards. But I know Zhushu's Musu mode also has this battle, so I'm not gonna worry about it that much. I'm not gonna really be concerned. Maybe I defeated the officers wrong. I had to defeat them in a certain order. Did he just try to do a Musou attack and I stopped him? I'm not seeing things. I could have sworn I just saw that. And that's a win. All right, so let's see. I guess I'll do it next time. Let's see how long it took. So it took a little under 17 minutes. That's not bad. Weapons, uh, yuck. Uh, the, the weapons are pretty nice. Uh, the not. That that one's kind of nice, but this no. Um, I'm still gonna go with the charge because I like how quickly I get my boost of charge. Items, I doubt we're gonna get anything. Yeah. All right, so let's see how you're supposed to get the auto war because apparently I tried twice, and the first time I ignored, I tried to go for both of them, and well, it just doesn't work. Um. Every time I do this on free mode, though, the item appears, and I don't get it. I mean, I'm not going to get it. I'm going to get it when I do it on video. It says, oh, 6,200 points. Not bad. We got 319 KO count, which is okay, especially when we got more points per KOs. All right, so the auto war effect temporary items last 30 30% longer, so I thought it was double time. Okay, I guess I was wrong. Uh, see to her fake castle, new castle. You have to play on wayside like I did. You have to defeat all enemy generals after a while. I guess you do have to wait. A precious item report will appear on Soon Chuan's ship, or in this case, an Muslim boat, Soon Jian ship. So, yeah. I apparently did that and nothing happened. Anyway, we'll save. I could always do it in free mode if it doesn't happen next time. And here's the ending for Zhang Liao.
想疲劳，装作无所谓。我搂紧丝毫，孤立的容貌，享受。And that's the Musa mode for Zhong Liao. All right, so that's another Musa down, and we have four more to go. And uh, we ha haven't unlocked anyone. Obviously, there's only one character left to unlock. And uh, yeah, I've been really lazy with the sat maxing so I completed Zenji but I was still working on Ganning but uh I am hoping to get it all done by the end of all the Musa modes but uh like I said I was gonna have at least some done if not all done by Zhang Liao's Musa mode but get well gets I was that, that's not happening <laughs> anyway so that's pretty much it. That's Zhang Liao's Musa mode. And the next Musa mode we'll be doing is Xiao Qiao. Uh, that, that's the only character that we need to unlock. Well, this is the only character we need to complete the Musa mode for to unlock the last character that we haven't unlocked yet. And it's on the other forces. Her name's Nuwa. And in order to unlock her, you have to defeat the Musa mode for every single female character. Within the three kingdoms, Diao Chan and Zhu Rong don't count. You have to beat Musa modes for Xiao Qiao, well, the Xiao sisters basically, uh, Sun Chang Zhang, and Zenji. Feels like I'm missing somebody for some reason. No, those four. Anyway, I guess that's it. You've been watching my gaming adventures, and I'll see you for the next part, which will be Xiao Qiao's Musa mode. Peace.